This local sports report is brought to you by Peter Izio from Izio Financial Solutions, helping you ensure financial stability for your family or business. Call Peter today for expert advice from an experienced advisor. Call now to book an appointment at 519-576-5410. Time flies sometimes in university football and Will Amoa, a local product going into his fifth and final season here with the Laurier Golden Hawks. Really hard to believe that it's gone by this quickly. Obviously this year is important for you going out on top and having the best season possible that you can. Um, how's your experience been at Laurier for the past four years and how excited are you for the fall? Oh, my experience has been remarkable. Like there's so many things I could all possibly like, bring up. But um, like everything so far has been really good. Like I feel like everything that I wanted has come into plan, like how I prepared. So I'm just really excited to see what's up to come. You had the opportunity to go to the East West Bowl, compete there. Uh, you're a defensive back. Obviously that was a very cool opportunity for you. Just describe that, that experience and what it was like to be recognized and go there and play amongst some very elite players. Uh, it was definitely surreal. Um, being around all those great athletes from all around Canada made me seem like, man, like I'm up here, so it's like something to be proud of. But like it also opened my eyes to like you can't take breaks off because like the next guy's up just just right there. Every year is different in OUA football. Obviously, you had a strong defense last year. When you look at this year's group, some of the players that are coming back, maybe some of the new additions, the guys moving into different roles, how do you view the defense and what are we going to see from the Golden Hawks this year? Uh, we're going to be a force to be reckoned with. That's what I'd have to say, man. We're just we're ready to go. We're very hungry for what's to, up and to come. And uh, there's a lot of young guys that are ready to step up and take the roles of the guys that are left, like such as Scott Hutter and whatnot. Mm -hmm. But yeah, the young guys are ready to go. Vet guys are also ready to go, motivated. For you to see 12 guys from this program start the season in the CFL, mm -hmm. not all of them are starters, but yeah. they are on the roster. This program is developing talent for the next level. I think it's a great compliment to Michael Falds, to the coaching staff, to everybody here, what they're doing. How proud are you to see that as a player, your brothers, your friends competing in the CFL? Oh yeah, definitely guys that I've came in with that are in the pros, like Scott Hutter, mm -hmm. the only two DVs that were recruited in here, man, I was so excited for him. <laughs> it's something that like I have aspirations to like see happen for me but if not then that's not really my end goal but like I'm really happy to see some of the guys do what they do in the CFL. You mentioned that the team is hungry this year and I imagine a lot of that has to do with missing the playoffs last mm -hmm. year. I don't want you to focus on that because that's in the past and that's what happened last fall but for this year's team how much of a motivator is it given the fact what happened last year you guys know that you want to get back to being an elite level program this year how do you plan to do that Will? Uh, I believe that like with all the guys that we with the work that we're putting in the summer I feel that this is what is going to be the outcome of the season like we've put in a lot of work in the weight room out on the field just coming together like DBs meeting like every once a week to kind of come together to practice I think it's going to be a, a team to be reckoned with for sure. Thank you Willemo for the time we certainly appreciate it and best of luck this coming fall it's coming quickly like oh, we yeah. said. Oh yeah for sure. Yeah Laurier opening the regular season here at University Stadium on Sunday August 25th at one o'clock against the Western Mustangs. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.